Hello everyone and welcome. Oh, hello. Good start. Thank you, sir. <laughs> oh, one of my trees grew. That's that's lovely. Um, I have a little bit of maintenance to do this morning. I'm just going to quickly repair my sword. For those of you who didn't know, you can do that. Uh, a little bit of... Well, I haven't really got any maintenance to do. I'll yeah, just dig this out, actually, real quick. Put you there. And say hello to the iron that is waiting there. Uh, I don't know, can we get rid of these safely? What's the light level at here? Yeah, that's fine, that can stay as it is. Good, good, okie dokie. So... Let's sort this out first. Let's do the storage spaces. Um, I don't know how many chests I need. But I don't think I need 16. So let's just get 8. And see what we have. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, right. So eight. So we need eight, sixteen, twenty-four, twenty. F wait, uh, twenty-two. Because I've got the two upstairs. So we need twenty-two chests. Jolly good. <coughs> no, I'm not going to get it on this one. Okay, that's thirteen. Wow, I need a lot of wood. Oh, that's still not enough. Look at that. Okay, two more. Two more chests. And then we can call the job a good one, but I haven't got enough wood, and my trees aren't ready yet. One of them is. But that's not enough, so never mind. Um, in that case, then, we're going to mix up some stuff, and it uh, looks like we're going caving today. And I think, first of all, I'm going to grab these as well. First job on the list today is to go down to that cave which had the lava level, <coughs> so that I can grab the all the good stuff that was waiting down at lava level for me. So, without further ado, let's go and have a look at what is down in the... I have no food! I am a fool! This is such an epic start. I think the day's going to go well. Come here, steak. Take the apples as well, just in case. No telling how long we're going to be down there. Let's go! Let's go! Let's start healing as well, because I'm in hardcore and I need to keep my health at full health, because otherwise I'm going to die. I should know this by now, after the escape with the spiders. Oh, and it's raining in that solitary bit of water. It's pretty great. <laughs> oh, Minecraft weather. How silly you are. Anyway, let's go down. Probably commandeer this torch, actually. I only put that there in the fit of lack of brightness last time. Last time we was down here. <gasps> Did I? I see an Enderman! But, like I say, I don't want to deal with them in caves, really. Only because I haven't really worked out how to deal with them in caves yet. Uh, I will do eventually, but I I don't know. We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there, everyone. Ho! Hello. <laughs> Ow! Oh, look at that. You know, three hearts from a single arrow. 
pretty hard, you know. Okay, so it's not that way. Lava level, where are you? Are you down here? No. <laughs> I mean, we know that we kind of have to head down. Were you through here? I think you were. I didn't see what time I started recording. So, this might be an accidentally long episode. Apologies. But, uh, yeah, apologies. Whoa, spider. I don't know where, but I heard one, and he was very close. And that bothers me more than that zombie does. Ow! If only because I don't want it dropping on my head. Is he down there? I think he is. Oh, damn it. Don't know where though. Oh, he's further away now. Okay. Then let's get some gold. Sorry about that, everyone. I went really silent there, but I got rather worried. <laughs> oh, and I have no blocks to deal with the lava, so let's just grab this dirt here. Now, how safe is it underneath? Reasonably, by the looks of it. But I don't know how long that safety continues for. Oh, uh, what's in here? Okay. Then, that is fine. We shall continue on our way. And the redstone there. Is that something I'm interested in? Yes, of course it is. Just check in further up. As I said last time, to me, redstone is more valuable than diamonds. Although, don't get me wrong, I wouldn't turn down diamonds if a pack of them arose. A pack. A pack of diamonds. Wow. I want to try and get some kind of levelling up system going as well for... What, wait, what am I trying to say? Some kind of... Um, like mob grinder or something perhaps just you know so that I can enchant and things oh, where is he he is so near and I really can't tell where he is and I hate it Oh, I thought he was up there. Oh, stupid spider hissing. I'm going to get this gold and I'm going down to the big lava pool over there. Whoa! Ho, 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 ho! What on earth is going on in there? Ho, ho! Ladies and gentlemen... We are... Uh, well, we have things that we have to explore. I have a feeling it might all be part of the same lava pit here, but... Never mind. Okay, I'm going to introduce you to my lava level digging tactic here. And you kind of saw it briefly when we was dealing with that tiny little pool over there. But what I tend to do is dig a path that is at least too wide. Uh, just so that it is safer. Uh, purely, yeah, that is for the reason. Purely because it is safer. Like you don't have as much chance of running off, and if mob starts attacking you, you've got a bit of give and things like that. I mean, I've lost count of the amount of experiences where, you know, things have gone wrong, 
around lava level. Not necessarily that it would have been saved by a too wide path, but things can go really wrong. Like one of my friends, we was on a server together, and you know we had been on a really successful mining trip, and he was walking around, and then all of a sudden, uh, like uh, a window must have popped up or something, and he uh, he got locked out of the game. His character kept on moving forward straight into the lava, and well, needless to say, we lost a lot of valuable stuff. And I'm not just talking redstone here. I mean diamonds and gold and coal. Uh, you name it, it went into the lava. So, you know, just saying, even if it ends up being something like this, you know, it's also, generally speaking, it might prove to be a bit fruitful. You know, you might find things. We wouldn't have found this iron, for example, if we was just digging a one wide hole or oh, walkway, sorry. You know, look look at how this vein's turning out. It's doing all right for itself, isn't it? That was a that was a nice little vein. And if that does happen I always try and make a point of covering it back up. Just just in case, you know. Like well not really just in case of anything. Just because like um Ooh, creeper fell in the lava. Uh, just because it's easier to get around. You know, if you have to suddenly run back or something, if you start getting chased, you won't fall into a hole and get stuck. And stuff like that. You know, it is a bit laborious. And yes, you do lose your pick, but... Pardon me. Right, with the stone pick here for example, it doesn't matter because look at the amount of stone you get back this is why I prefer stone tools over other ones anyway, just because stone is the most abundant material in the game and as far as I'm concerned there isn't really much difference between a, a stone pick and an iron one except for the fact the iron one lasts a bit longer you know, the iron one can get different ores out and that's the only reason I use an iron one to try and get ores out that I wouldn't be able to normally get out other than that I use uh, stone ones just purely for the fact that it, like if you run out of cobblestone or stone during your game you are playing it really wrong essentially and yeah that's why I always use stone just because there's so much of it about and it's really easy to get hold of See, and again, thank you to the two wide pathway here. We found this lovely coal slash iron vein going on here, which is being very productive. Look at this. This is great. So I think soon I'm going to head up to the surface and we're going to drop all of this off and we're going to continue working on whatever I was working on when we left. Um, the storage room, yes. We stopped working on the storage room because of all my trees needing to regrow. So, we'll do that, or we'll go out and get wood at least. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we'll go out and get wood and we'll carry on doing that. Also, like I've been saying for a few episodes now, I want to get some kind of farming... Uh, thing established because we've been just sort of scraping by on food for a while and I kind of want to get something a bit more sustainable up. So that will be, that's on our list of things to achieve. All the while looking out for ender pearls and diamonds so that we can make an enchanting table and a diamond pick to grab some obsidian which will enable us to go to the nether and all the usual stuff so I know like I said this the objective of this LP is to get to the end and kill the dragon in hardcore mode uh, and if you were expecting it to be well underway by now sorry and I think I was kind of expecting it to be underway by now as well but I've kind of only just realised actually how much work needs to be done before you can get e even get to the nether, you know. 
So do bear with, and we're having fun anyway. If we're, you know, doing all this is quite good and getting practice up. You know, like I say, I'm on I'm on my friend's server a lot, and you know, we have a great time, and I like showing off and things. So all of this is good practice for showing off and for dealing with the survivor situation su server sorry server situations because the problem with being on a server is of course the inevitable lag and things like that so this is all good all in good jest for trying to get that sorted out the spider is still around and driving me nuts let's let's just get out of here head home and see where we're at because also like I said I wasn't paying a you are on fire for so two of you are on fire for see what you guys did there was you just walked straight through that lava didn't you, you pillocks <laughs> anyway yeah like I was saying I don't remember what time I started recording this so you know for all I know a whole whole minecraft day and night cycle could have slipped past while we've been down here oh god that's the wrong way I don't think it has but just Hello, cave noise. Just in case, let's get out. We've got stuff we can be doing anyway. It's not like we're going to get home and then just sit there and twiddle our thumbs for a while. Nearly at the top. We're nearly at the top. This is how I get out. Okay, it's still night time. That's fine. So we can go... I've got some gravel there. We'll get that ready just in case there's an enderman I want to... Uh, common deer but it doesn't appear that there is never mind let's go scrounging for one shall we oh neither of you are endermen however if you wish to be relieved I shall relieve you oh you could jump up there okay Also, it's all good XP for enchanting, so you know there's no there's no downsides to it other than the fact that we could possibly die, which I'll admit is a pretty big one. But um, out, out, out. Hopefully that won't happen. It will if we carry on playing like that. But I am fully intending to stop playing like that. Oop. Hey there, Mr. Renderman, where are you? I require some of your golden pearls. They're not really golden, they are a little bit blue. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter when your name is Sue. I don't know if their name is Sue. It's just, uh, if anything, it's a pseudonym. Ha 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 ha! Um, I was so bowled over by my own joke, I decided to dig that snow up with an axe. Burr, 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 burr. What awaits behind these double doors? Why, it's home, of course. Ho, 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 ho. So, how many chests did I say I needed? Two. There's two chests. For us to put down here. Okay. And then the sun has come up. Which means that next time, for definite, we are going to uh, sort out the storage room and get some farming underway. And that will definitely happen next time. In fact, I'm so sure of it, I'm going to make the tea I said I would make in the last episode, but didn't. And I am going to record that episode right now. So, uh, thank you very much for watching, everybody. See you in the next one, whenever it is. And...